So what I want this to do for this problem is to evaluate g of x equals negative uh, x squared. And I want to evaluate, instead of for my terms of x, I want to evaluate for what is going to be the value of my function g for a plus 1. So this represents the value of my function at x. So to find the value of the function of a plus 1, I'm going to have to plug in my a plus 1 into my function, which is x, negative x squared. So I'll have a negative a plus 1 squared. And then here, what I can do is I can represent, this represents a plus 1 squared. So I have negative a plus 1 times a plus 1. Then, using my FOIL techniques, I multiply the front two terms, which is going to give me an a squared first. Then I multiply the outer terms, which will give me a, a times 1, which is a. My inner terms, which again will give me a. And then 1 times 1, my um, last terms give me 1. I can combine my middle terms negative a squared plus 2a plus 1. And then my last step is now to distribute my negative sign to all of my three terms. So I end up with a negative a squared minus 2a minus 1. So g of a plus 1 is equal to a negative a squared minus 2a minus 1. And that's how you evaluate a function uh, for when you have g of a plus 1.